take your rear wishbone provided in this stage and remove the excess sprue mold here um, just gently testing that off just take off any excess plastic like so once again just gently removing these be careful obviously with a knife you can use a pair of sharp tweezers just to clean those off just clear that area off okay Next we're going to be putting the ball screw into the rear wishbone, so just put that into position as soon and then take your screwdriver and then screw that one securely into place. Now don't over tighten it, but just allow enough so that it starts to get tight like so and it's nice and flush with the top. Okay, now once you've done that, take your 6.8mm pillow ball and what we're going to be doing is we're going to be putting that into the end of the shorter of the two control arms here. So once again just take that and you should be able to just pop that into position making sure that the flat is at the bottom of the control. Um, if not, you can always use a pair of pliers, which I think I'll probably do on this occasion. If not, if I can just push that down. There we go, that one's in position. Okay. Take your chassis and just notice that the 6.8mm ball head screw is going to be going and it's going to be going in this position here. I just hold that up and show you it's that location there so if you're coming from the front it's the second one so once again take that screw just get that to start up and then screw that into position once again take it all the way down but not over tightening it. Once you've done that, take your rear wishbone, pop that into position like so. Take the remaining screw that came with this part and then screw that into position like so